Well done, Brit. Amazing, amazing trophy. This is a giant. Well done. Thank you, Welcome back to the African Allure Outdoors. As you can see, today we are hunting African bush pig. These animals are often referred to as the poor man's leopard. They take an incredible amount of preparation work to get these animals to a level, as you see in this case, where we can actually hunt them with a bow. It takes weeks and weeks and a lot of pre-bait to get these animals this habituated. One of the reasons that we have a pile of rocks like this is that it keeps the porcupines away from the bait pile and the other thing as well is, is that it creates some form of noise when the archer is busy drawing back his bow and is getting ready to make his shot. Males weigh between 60 and 80 kilograms, that's 130 to 180 pounds and they do attain a mass of up to 330 pounds. Although in the area where we operate, uh, which is in the Lipapa province, our pigs don't gain that size. We are more in the mid-range of say 60 to 70 kilograms. And uh, this animal is often referred to as the poor man's leopard because they are very elusive. They have a very keen sense of hearing, a very keen sense of smell. Their eyesight is poor, but it's not bad. They can actually see quite well. You can see in this video that this man animal is alert, he is aware that is something that is going on and is thus as a result rather skittish. Now the archer had been here the previous year, uh, he had used a mid-range arrow between 400 and 500 grains with a 70 pound bow. He had got a good um, penetration into the animal, however the animal did manage to survive and we saw the animal um, two weeks later with a rather large abscess on the opposite side. This year the hunter is back. He's now got a 75 pound bow. He's shooting a heavier arrow. He's using a fixed cut on contact broadhead and he's managed to get the job done. So enjoy the video. Yeah, I've been in contact with Ryan for quite a while now, um, monitoring this pig, uh, probably a good three weeks and uh, probably the last five days, maybe a week or so, we got given the opportunity to potentially take him in the day, which came to fruit now, which was fantastic. Um, I don't think there's a lot of guys that have shot bush pig in the day, uh, let alone with bow, so I just want to say thanks to Ryan um, for all the effort, all the hard work and everything and setting me up on the pig, uh, fantastic pig. Uh, one shot. Um, complete pass through and he made maybe 30 40 yards and then we found him yeah uh, just to, for some background last year I came um, and I shot a bush pig um, <laughs> call it a tag and release because he's still walking around we think um, we think we have seen him uh, much lighter arrows uh, did use a fixed blade but not a very strong fixed blade um, switched to silver flame 125 grain arrows uh, these ones here got a complete pass through on them um, it is only 12 or 14 yards, but last year was the exact same distance. Uh, I think we had about 10 centimeters penetration with a 430 grain arrow. We're up to about 525 now, and yeah, the difference is just completely, completely different.